all depends on removing the obstacles in the pathway because the energy, the interest, the desire is there. I think of my own country, the U.S., where so many young new farmers want to farm this way, and yet land is so expensive, it is very, very hard to get started. So it's not that the desire isn't there, it's how do we, and this is a political question, a fundamental political question, how do we create a more real democracy in, in my country, and I think it's similar in other countries where the desire is there. And in some European countries, of course, there's much more support for this transformation. But uh, So it does depend a great deal on the government, but fundamentally it's about creating what I call living democracy, democracy that really is accountable to the people so that that desire, it's not as if it has, the desire has to be created. Um, and some of the greatest advances are happening in the global south. And one, one example of how these can move to scale, are moving to scale, they're not just little village here, little village there. But for example, the state of Andhra Pradesh in India, which is a huge southern state in India that has been seen as the pesticide capital of the world that got hooked on chemical and capital intensive agriculture. But people were, know that, knew they were being poisoned by the pesticides and they were spending a third of everything they earned uh, from selling their crops. They were spending on seeds and pesticides and fertilizers and they finally said no, 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 no. And now, you know, farmer to farmer, they're actually making commitments at the village level to one another. And so we're now talking about between one and two million acres, uh, 300,000 farmers, more than 8,000 villages. So this is not anymore just a very tiny example. It is beginning to go to scale. And so I think that combination is what is going, you know, the political movements and the, the farmer to farmer saying, okay, I've had enough. I want something better.